In this lesson, we will compute the limit, the limit as x approaches pi over 2 of left parenthesis secant cubed x minus tangent cubed x right parenthesis divided by tangent x. We will show every algebra and limit step clearly. Step 1. Use a small angle substitution. Let t equal pi over 2 minus x. Then as x goes to pi over 2, t goes to 0. We have x equals pi over 2 minus t. So tangent of x equals tangent of pi over 2 minus t, which is cotangent t. Also, secant of x equals 1 over cosine x equals 1 over cosine of pi over 2 minus t, which is 1 over sine t, that is cosecant t. Therefore, secant cubed x becomes cosecant cubed t, tangent cubed x becomes cotangent cubed t, and the denominator tangent x becomes cotangent t. So the expression becomes left parenthesis cosecant cubed t minus cotangent cubed t right parenthesis over cotangent t. Step 2. Simplify algebraically using sine and cosine. Write cosecant cubed t as 1 over sine cubed t and cotangent cubed t as cosine cubed t over sine cubed t. Then the numerator becomes 1 minus cosine cubed t all over sine cubed t. Now divide by cotangent t, which is multiply by sine t over cosine t. We obtain the single fraction left parenthesis 1 minus cosine cubed t right parenthesis over left parenthesis sine squared t times cosine t right parenthesis. Step 3. Use small t expansions. As t goes to 0, cosine t equals 1 minus t squared over 2 plus higher order, and sine t equals t minus t cubed over 6 plus higher order. Compute cosine cubed t, that is approximately 1 minus 3 t squared over 2 plus higher order. Therefore, 1 minus cosine cubed t is approximately 3 t squared over 2 plus higher order. Also, sine squared t is approximately t squared, and cosine t is approximately 1. Substituting into the fraction, the numerator is about 3 t squared over 2, and the denominator is about t squared times 1. So the ratio tends to 3 halves. Step 4. Conclusion. The limit as x approaches pi over 2 of left parenthesis secant cubed x minus tangent cubed x right parenthesis over tangent x equals 3 halves. Thanks for watching my verse maths. If this helped you, hit that like button, drop a comment, share it with your friends, and don't forget to subscribe for more quick maths tricks and proofs. See you in the next one.